Today I want to show you how I use Loop Cloud to make music on a daily basis and come up with quick ideas that I can then use to build a full track. So I hope you can enjoy this and you learn something from it. Let's jump into it. Open Loop Cloud in your DAW. And what the whole idea is about this program is making cool sketches and then moving on to your DAW and building it out. So I like to look for samples first before I start making music. So as you can see, I went to my favorites and I'm just going to go through some sounds and see what comes out. It's all the idea about it is just going quick. So I'm also going to make tempo quicker because I'm fast. <laughs> So I found this cool sample. Me free, yeah. I'm going to cut it up me free, by holding down option. Me free, yeah. And then you can drag yeah. the length of the sample to what Set you want. Me free, yeah. I'm going to start out with this vocal as my idea. And I'm going to make this pattern a little longer. So I'm going to copy the sample. And by doing, uh, I'm holding down option, uh, sorry, command on the Mac. Set me free. Set I'm gonna add a delay to this. All right, that's cool enough. Time for track two. So I'm gonna go add a bass line. Let's see what we got for the loops. That's pretty cool. So you can change the patterns real quick, just hitting the pattern button. I like to go to the hi-hat patterns sometimes and find some weird sample, find some weird pattern. I like this, that's kind of working. Let me change this part here. Oh, that's cool. All right. So maybe a different sound. That works for now. Okay, so I'm going to copy this over a little, make the, pat make the loop a little longer. And I'm thinking what I want to do is change the notes, the pitch on some of these samples. So let's see. Give me a moment here to noodle this out. I'm going to go to the tools box in a second and ch select the pitch mode. Change the length of the loop first. Pitch. Here we go. Let's see if this works. I'm just noodling. Okay, that's gonna work. I think it's gonna work. Yeah. Add this to one. Okay. I still like this sample, but let's see what else we got. Full on rave, baby. Clap. Again, copy by holding down command. Slow this down to pitch it down. Add an effect. Reverb. That should make it sound a bit more fat. Time for a kick. So I went through these kicks. I put together some of my favorite kicks, so I know most of these are gonna work. And the first one I try is already working. So we can still change this later, anytime. It's super easy. It's time for a hi hats. Let's add a little Detroit style pattern of hi hat. But the sound needs to be different, but I'm just coming up with the idea for now. The pattern. Okay, that's hitting a bit more. Yeah, I like that. I like that. Okay. See? It's just random stuff. Just press the random pattern and boom. Yep. This is working. Pay for that later. So, what else we got here? Let's add a ride. Wait, the first one? Yep. That one's working. I like that one. See, we pretty much got the idea done. I just want to add another sound in here. See what we get. 
that pattern so I'm just gonna sometimes I like to make my own let's go through those and see if anything works okay that one's working that's good that's good all right now let's move this over to Ableton and keep on noodling so once we move it over there we can still go back and forth it's super easy to do so let's go that's a nice little sketch, if I may say so. So I'm going to go to Ableton and to Loop Cloud at the same time. I'm going to go back and forth. We drag it in. As you can see, I made a nice template to make it easy on myself. So let's Set drag this into the right places. Set I'm not going to teach you how to do Ableton, me free, me free, but I'm going to do a nice free, little jam. Set me free, me free, Maybe shut up a little bit more. Me free, Set me free, Set me free, Set me free, Set me free. Set me free. Set me free. Set me free, me free, that 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 me free. So the nice thing, all these tracks are already looped. Everything's ready to go. Me free, me free, that 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 me free, me free. Little compressor to this, side chain. Me free, that me free, me free, that me free, me free, that me free. Something out here. I don't know if this is gonna work. Duplicate that again. I'm gonna make a shorter loop out of this one. And just maybe do a little transition. Okay, let's go back to Loop Cloud. Find this bass line I was using earlier. It's called Command Something. Where is it? Come on. Okay, okay. Drag it in. Bring it into the bass part. Now I'm going to stop all these other loops. To loop cloud, we're gonna choose another little loop, maybe another high end. It's working. Okay, let's drag that in. Easy, Maybe slow it down a little, pitch it down to like a violin. Let's see what we got. The ride channel. I like to be organized. Ooh, yeah, baby. This was up. that shit to CD and become a millionaire. Alright, that's it guys. I'm telling you, it's that easy. You just come up with ideas, with sketches, and then you build it out to a full track in your DAW. You can change out all the samples to whatever you want. It's it's about the coming up with the idea, you know? Then you can go from there and do anything you want, but you're getting there much quicker. Instead of noodling on a, ba on a kick for five hours, you have someone else do it 
and upload it to Loop Cloud, and then you can just play with it. Million Bear.